And it's so nice to hear that Alan is going to have that great voice on the radio again. Well, hello, everybody. I am Dr. Annette Tejero, and I'm running for Congressional District 3. I do have a unique thing to offer, by the way, and I'm going to say this up front because none of my opponents anywhere can actually do this. When I go to Congress, and they keep up their dysfunctional, disastrous offer, stuff that we don't want, I have something that I can pull out of my bag of tricks. As an anesthesiologist, I can put them all to sleep. I can do everything that we all know needs to be done. And then I can wake them up and say to them, it's okay, everything went just fine. Now that, that's a pretty good plan B, don't you think? But all kidding aside, my family's been here for 39 years. I come from a low-income family, and we struggle. Because my family believed that education was one of the most important things that we could do, we all sacrificed, and I worked, and I did go to Bishop Gorman High School and graduated in the same class that Danny did. What a lot of you don't know is that on graduation night, I was an honor student. I didn't get my diploma that night. I didn't get my diploma because we had not finished paying Gorman for the fees. It was a tough summer that summer, but I worked and paid it off just in time so that I could start at UNLV. And I continued to work through part of medical school. That's important so you understand my dedication. I am a medical doctor. There are 17 physicians in 535 members of Congress. There are 184 lawyers. God bless them. I'm married to one. But we all know where that's taken us. I have other things to offer as well. I am one of the few doctors that has read, reviewed, testified, and helped amend legislation for our own state of Nevada, and sometimes given advice to a congressman that sits in this seat right now. I know Obamacare very well. That's important because we need someone that on day one, ladies and gentlemen, day one, can walk in and read and rewrite those bills. You may want to know more. I encourage you to go to AnnetteForCongress.com to find out more. I am also a small business owner. I understand more than anybody how regulation can alter people's physical health and your business. It can cut off the lifeblood of our entire entrepreneurship, our economy. I also am the wife of a veteran. Can I have all the veterans in this room stand up or raise your hand? Because we need to put our hands together to thank our veterans. It's personal, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. I'm the mother of three homeschooled children. As I said before, education is very important for our family. Thank you, Dr. Lou. One of our candidates for uh, state uh, board, the, uh, the school board, am I right? Okay, um, the other thing that you need to know about me is that as I bring all these things to Congress, all these things that I've been talking about, all the experience that I have, we can
can together do things that we can't do with any other candidate. For instance, one of the most important things you hear from our media is the Hispanic vote. I am a bilingual Hispanic. We can reach out to that community. And I just can prove that with my last run in Congressional District 1, where there was only 22% Republican registration, and I got 38% of the vote. A lot of crossover vote there. That's important for the general. And there are things that we can accomplish together. We can repeal and replace Obamacare. We can fix our veterans' health care system. We can stop Common Core dead in its tracks on a federal level. We can unleash our small business owners' entrepreneurship and create jobs and prosperity for Americans. We can also learn to live within our means. We can balance our budget, just like all the mothers and fathers that are sitting here that we have to balance our budget at home. These are important things to take to Congress, and there is a lot more. I ask for your vote. I ask for your support. My name is Dr. Annette Tejero for Congress in Congressional District 3. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Dr. Annette Tejero, ladies and gentlemen.